Hi, welcome to Collie Biology. Today for Biology 112 at Aiken Technical College, we're going to review the superficial musculature. We're going to start with the head and the face. There are a series of muscles that correspond to the names of the bones that they overlie on the cranial cavity. The muscle that we have up front, both the right and left hand side, is the frontalis muscle. Runs right over the frontal bone. Along the side, above the temporal bone, we have the temporalis muscle. And on the back, over the occipital bone of the skull, we have the occipitalis. On the side of the skull, we have the large muscle that's going to allow us to chew, run straight up and down to the mandible or the lower jaw. That's the masseter muscle. And if we look at the front, we've got two ringed or circular muscles. One goes around the eye and one goes around the mouth. The muscle around the eye is the orbicularis oculi muscle, orbicularis oculi. And the muscle around the mouth is the orbicularis oris muscle. Okay, we're going to move a little lower on the body and look at the posterior musculature. Okay, we look at the posterior surface. Once again, there's the ocularis muscle. We have a big diamond kite shaped muscle along the back. That's the trapezius muscle. Running along the entire backside, huge sheets of muscle on the dorsal surface, latissimus dorsi. You can see the deltoid muscle running across the point of the shoulder. We can also see the triceps brachii muscle on the back of the arm. A little lower, the round portion of the buttocks is the gluteus maximus muscle. A little higher on the gluteus maximus muscle, right where the saddlebags are back there, that's the gluteus medius muscle. Let's turn them around and look at the anterior surface. All right, on the anterior surface when musculature, we see the deltoid. Once again, that same muscle that forms the point of the shoulder. On the front of the arm, we have the biceps brachii. The chest muscle on both right and left side is your pectoralis major muscle. Your six-pack muscles running on the outside are the rectus abdominis muscles. And then the muscle that frames the side of your abdominal cavity is the external oblique. There are three layers of muscle in this region of the body. External oblique, that one we can see. Beneath there is the internal oblique, and beneath that one, transverse abdominis. All right, so let's look at the legs. All right, you have a series of muscles associated with your femur bone or the thigh. The muscle that runs across the thigh is the sartorius muscle. The muscle that runs straight up and down your thigh on either side is the rectus femoris muscle. Femoris refers to the femur. And then along the rectus femoris, you have a muscle to the inside, the medial side, and a muscle to the outside, the lateral side. Both of these are your vastus muscles. The one on the inside is the vastus medialis muscle. And the muscle on the outside is the vastus lateralis muscle. And then running directly in front of the tibia bone on your lower limb is the tibialis anterior. Let's flip it around look at the back side. Once again, you have your gluteus maximus muscle being the point of your buttocks. Two muscles that run parallel, two big beefy muscles that run along the back side of your thigh. The one on the outside is the biceps femoris. Once again, the femoris referring to the femur. And then the one that runs parallel is the semi-tendinosus. The entire muscle of the calf is the gastrocnemius muscle. And those are your muscles.